Hey guys, it's James again. Today I wanted to make a video about loving yourself. Recently, I've seen a lot of hate comments on my friends' social media pages, and I've had a lot of conversations with them about, you know, when people just say negative things about you that they know nothing about, it can hurt. Bullying is something that's never gonna go away. We're not ever gonna get rid of it. The only thing that we can learn to do is encourage one another and get through it. The way that you do that is to love yourself. Loving yourself means knowing your value and your worth and being secure in that, right? Some people out there, they're like, yeah, I'm just looking out for number one. It's like, no, you're just being an ass. Like, how you know that a person genuinely loves themselves is how they love on other people. And, and so today I'm gonna talk about some of the steps that you can take to get to that place of self-worth. Right? Number one, surround yourself with good people. Life is too short to waste time with negative people. Get the negative people out of your life. It's not worth it. Find yourself with good, active people that encourage you in where you wanna go in life. Number two, stop worrying about what other people think. That doesn't mean go and have this attitude of like, well, fuck everybody. No, what it means is live your life. If we live our lives tiptoeing around everything and worrying about what everybody thinks, you're never gonna accomplish the things that you wanna accomplish. You can't move forward if you're always looking back, worried what other people are thinking. Number three, find something that you love to do. I mean you, not your friends, you, that you personally just love to do. And make time for it at least once a week. One day a week, just make it your day and go and do it. It will make your life so much better. Find it and a lot time for it. You deserve it. You deserve to do something that you love to do. If it makes you happy, then go do it. Unless it's illegal. Number four, the thing you have to understand about people that try and bring you down is that they are unhappy with their lives. So they want to bring you down to their level. Misery loves company. If someone's miserable, they don't like seeing other people happy. It helps so much more knowing that that person's in a place of hurt. You have to understand that they're not even mad at you. They're mad at where they are in life. I realized that it made my life so much easier because I stopped taking things personally. When, when people comment on videos or Instagram posts, like for them to say hurtful things, it doesn't matter to me because I know that that's their problem, it's not mine. Don't allow them to bring you down just because they're in a bad place. All right, number five, create goals. Creating goals gives you purpose. Everybody needs purpose in life. If you don't live with a purpose, then you're aimlessly wandering around. Point B to this is watch positive people. My person that I like to watch, The Rock. If you don't like The Rock, that dude is awesome. You gotta, you gotta follow him on social media. He's the most inspirational dude. Him and Kevin Hart are hilarious, and they are workhorses. Those dudes do not stop working. Those are my go-to. You gotta find who motivates you. What person's life inspires you to live a better life? As you see someone doing it, it will help you get motivated to go and do it yourself. I'll end with this. Belief is the most powerful thing in the world. If you believe that you can go and do something and you work at it, then you can go do it. Listen to Kevin Hart talk about how if he wanted to be an NBA basketball player, he could go do it. When you see him say it, he believes it to his core. Now, people can call that insanity all they want, but at the end of the day, he's getting shit done. The reason I made this video is I want to put out more life lessons, things I learned from my life. If they can help you along the way, then that's great. It's been a long road for me to love myself. I'm still learning it. It's a constant process. Your mind can be your biggest asset or your greatest hindrance. You can change your mindset. It will take time, but it's a mindset. You are the only person who defines you. What happens to you is up to you. So go do it. Get motivated. Love yourself, know your worth, and just love on people. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you want to see more videos like this, comment below. Uh, if you want any advice on anything, comment. I will always try and respond to the comments on YouTube. It's the platform that I respond to most. And if you liked it, give it a thumbs up. But that's it, guys. Much love. James out.